Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video I'm going to check the Gepper C Mark II 7 inch frame. In this video I'm going to assemble the frame, go over its specifications and hopefully in the next week or so I'm also going to feature it on the build video when I'm finally going to build my first long range racer. So let's start by opening the box and see all the components we're getting inside. Inside we're getting the assembly diagram, a simple PDB with an XT60 connector, two sets of stickers, an anti-skid battery sticker, two velcro straps for the battery, one velcro strap for a GoPro session camera, antenna tubes, all the spacers, mounts and screws, and also this rubber o-ring for the VTX antenna, this aluminum plate that holds the arms together, landing pad stickers, all the parts for the side plates, the top and bottom plates, and finally the arms. The thickness of each arm is 4 millimeters. The thickness of the top plate is 2 millimeters. The thickness of the bottom plate is 2 millimeters as well. And finally, we have two options for the side plates of the camera. We have these plates that have the option to mount an HD camera. And if you don't want this option, you can also use these two plates. The thickness of both side plates is about 2.1 millimeters. The next thing I'm going to do is quickly assemble the frame and then I'm going to wait up. So the frame is now ready, let's weigh it up. The weight of the frame is 137.6 gram. Here you can see how it compares to a 5 inch frame which I'm also going to build in the next few days. It has a wheelbase of 300 millimeters so it's much bigger than the 5 inch frame. But still 137 grams it's pretty light for a 7 inch build. In terms of moto options, this frame is compatible with 220X up to 24X motors. I'm going to use it with 2307 motors and the distance between the mounting holes is between about 20 millimeters up to about 16.6 millimeters. The maximum height for the stack is about 24.7 millimeters and the distance between these screws that will enable you to mount the stack is the standard 30.5 by 30.5 millimeters. So overall, as far as I can tell, the Mark II 7 inch frames look like a very solid option for a 7 inch build and I'm looking forward to see how it's going to perform after I'm going to build it in the next week or so. As always, if you have any questions about this frame, feel free to ask it in the comment section down below. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you like this video and consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell if you're not already subscribed. See you in my next videos and goodbye.